What is up guys, it is Champ here, back with another video, and today I am going to be showing you guys a quick guide on how to get the Maramasa, as I call it, the sword from the dungeon in Terraria. So what you're first going to need to do is you're going to need to use this seed, which I have linked in the description, but you're going to use this seed, yeah, I'm, I'm going to put it in the description, you're going to copy it, you're going to paste in here, great. Name, literally whatever you want. I'll put it as sword. Yeah. And then you're gonna, your settings are gonna wanna be small, classic, corruption. Default settings. So then, you're cre so then you're just gonna create the world. And I'll skip to when the world is done being created. All right, so then here you're gonna wanna find, you're gonna wanna find your world, so sword, yeah. So then you're going to be in your ter the Terraria world. So all you're going to want to do is however you feel like it, you're just going to want to go left. You could walk, you could grapple, you could do whatever, but you're just going to want to go left. And you just want to keep going left. Do not stop going left until you reach the dungeon. Where okay, so here it is. So then when you get here, you're going to need to defeat Skeletron, obviously. So you're going to have to wait for nighttime. And this old man will curse you, and then Skeletron will come. So I'll switch to night. <clears throat> and just a little FYI, you can't actually go down here um, before Skeletron spawns. Because there'll be a big rotating head that can one-tap kill you. Where is it? And there it is. So definitely do not go down there until you've defeated Skeletron. Alright, so now that it is nighttime, you're going to talk to the man, and then you can either curse or close, you're going to curse, it spawns, it's a super easy battle, like, just this stuff is going to kill it, I'm not even, literally, my hands are in the air, anyway, we kill it, great, so then, we can go in the dungeon, and the old man's gone, so now we can go in the dungeon, and it's really simple to get to the sword maramasa i think is how you pronounce it so you're gonna keep going down keep going down keep going down keep going down okay so this chest is actually where the maramasa is in this chest but it's locked so i'm going to show you where a gold key is that you can use to open it so you're just going to keep going down careful with spikes when you see this green fungi looking stuff Oh, don't, don't fall in that trap. I think there's another trap. Yep. Don't fall into any of those traps. So then right here, if you open the chest, there's going to be, boom, a gold key. Take the gold key, put it in your inventory, and then we're just going to go all the way back up to the chest, which actually isn't too far. You can use rope if you're, if you're earlier in the game. All the way back up past the table, and then here you are at the chest, and when you open it, boom. Here is the Maramasa in all its glory. Very fast sword. Pretty solid for early game. So uh, if you did enjoy this video, make sure to like and subscribe. When you like and subscribe, my video gets recommended to more people, which then can help more people get the sword. So yeah, I will see you all later. Peace.